Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, I review software to help you manage smart tech decisions. So if that sounds good, make sure to hit that subscribe button. So today we are diving deep into one of the most popular accounting tools on the market, QuickBooks by Intuit. Whether you're a freelancer, small business owner, or an accounting professional, chances are you've come across this name. But is it worth your time and money in 2025? Stick around. This review covers everything from UI to pricing to performance. So what is Quick QuickBooks all about? QuickBooks is an accounting software designed to help individuals and small to medium sized businesses manage their finances, bookkeeping and payroll in one central platform. Now the question is, who is it for? Primarily, it is geared toward um, small businesses, freelancers, consultants, and even mid-sized enterprises. It is also widely used by accountants managing multiple clients. So what are the main uh, use cases for, uh, what are the main use cases of QuickBooks? Uh, the main use cases include invoicing, expense tracking, task preparation, payroll management, bank reconciliation, inventory tracking, that's also on some plans, then generating detailed financial reports. It's essentially an only one toolkit for managing your business financial health without needing to be uh, a CPA. So let's quickly look at the user interface and user experience. So QuickBooks, has come a long way in terms of design. The interface is clean, as you can see. Uh, it is modern and in intuitively laid out. Now, if you come to Jehovah on the products and services, you will see how smart and how clean it is. Uh, if you come to the plan surprising by hovering your, uh, your, your mouse on it, you get to see the details of the plan and pricing. Then you come to top features, you get to see uh, the sub menu. Uh, these are the uh, the features of Intuit, uh, features of QuickBooks, uh, which include invoicing, express tracking, B management report, live booking, project profitability, e commerce sync, inventory, money tracking, I a lot of them. And when you come to business types, if you over on it, you will uh, get to see the industry that QuickBooks um, is designed for. And also, when you over on the resources, you get to see all the details um, on the resources um, menu. So you can see that the, uh, the user interface is very uh, clean, you know, smart, and um, uh, very easy to, to navigate. Now, the dashboard gives you a uh, high level view of your financials, like income, um, expenses, profits and loss at a glance. So for the US experience, uh, navigation is straightforward. As I rightly said, navigation is straightforward with logical menus for sales, expenses, reports, and banking. If you've used accounting software before, you will feel right at home. You feel right at home. Um, <clears throat> but uh, another aspect to to QuickBooks is the learning curve. For beginners, there are for beginners there is a bit of a learning curve, especially if you are not familiar with accounting terms. However, QuickBooks does a decent job of offering offering two tips. Uh, tutorials and guided setup flows to ease you in. All right, so um, that is it for the uh, features. Um, I'm sorry for the. That is it for the user interface and the uh, user experience. So we're just going to quickly discuss, um, you know, some of the key features of QuickBooks. So uh, the core features include uh, number one automated invoicing with customizable templates. Uh, another thing is that um, uh, 
it has express tracking by category and vendor, then bank syncing and reconciliation. Also, um, it has advanced reporting, including profit and loss, cash flow and balance sheet. Another thing is the task calculations and preparation help, payroll integration, which is available on higher plans or as an add-on. Then um, it has inventory, inventory tracking on the plus and advanced uh, plans. So what are the st standout tools? The receipt capture feature is super handy. You just snap a photo and QuickBooks automatically categorizes it. Then um, the smart automation for recurring invoices, B payment, and even payroll. The other two that stands out is the um, cash flow forecasting, which is available in the IRTA plans, which gives a predictive view of your uh, finances. So compared to alternatives like Zero Wave or Fresh Books, QuickBooks leads in feature depth and reliability, although it may not be the cheapest um, option. It may not be the, uh, the, the, cheap, the, the cheapest option in the market. Let's talk about the performance and reliability. So QuickBooks Online is cloud-based and generally very responsive. As you can see, it's, it's, it's very, very, very responsive. Very, very responsive. Like you can just by hovering on the menu, you already get to see details of that particular menu, and you can easily um, tap on the on the sub menu uh, you want to play with. You know, easily you get to open any of the uh, sub menu as you like without any uh, delay. So it is very smart. It's very fast and it's very fast and, and smart. So as for the reliability, it is robust, but occasional box or sync delays can happen. Okay, especially with third-party bank integration. Still, uh, QuickBooks is usually quick to resolve major issues. Okay, if you have a larger amount of data, like years of transactions, it handles scaling fairly well, especially with the advanced. Um, so that is it for the, the performance and re reliability. So uh, let's talk about the let's talk about integration and compatibility. QuickBooks integrates with over 750 apps, including Shopify, PayPal, Score, uh, Gusto, and more. So the platforms which uh, QuickBooks supports include the uh, include web which is browser based then also it supports um, windows and mac os um, but with a limited um, desktop version then it's it supports ios and android apps for managing on the go is api available yes quickbooks offer a restful api for developers making it great for custom workflows and integration now let's talk about pricing and plans quickbooks of offers several pricing tiers for its online version as of 2025 when you come to the plans and pricing you get to see um, details about the about the plans and the pricing so they have a simple start uh, plan, essentials plan, plus plan, and um, advanced plan. So for the simple start, uh, it is for basic needs, which takes care of um, invoicing, um, income and expenses. Uh, I mean, it takes care. It takes care of income and expenses. And as you can see here, it takes care of um, um, task deductions, general reports, receipt capture, money tracking, and a whole lot of them. Then for the essential, uh, essentials, 
that's for the essentials uh it adds b management and time to try and time tracking right it has be uh, a b, b management and time tracking then for the plus it adds inventory and project tracking as you can see here inventory project profitability financial and planning then for the for the advanced you get to see the additional features for the advanced option so the the cost for the advance is yeah, $3.50 per month then for the plus it is $9.90 per month and um, uh, for the essential it is $6.50 per month so uh, that is it for, for the pricing but then uh, I would like to say this uh, pricing ranges from five dollar per month to over two hundred dollar per month for the advanced plan, depending on promotions and add-ons. So you need to uh, understand that. So another question is: Are there hidden fees? Mm, not really, but add-ons like payroll, time tracking, or third part or third-party app integrations can bump up your cost. Yeah, you need to know that. Let's discuss the support and um, community. So let's discuss support and community. Uh, customer support is available via chat and phone, depending on your plan. Response times can vary, but support is generally helpful. Um, documentation is excellent. Offers detailed guides, video tutorials, and frequently asked questions. There's also an in-app help center. Then as for the community, it is very, very huge. Uh, the QuickBooks community forum is active and many YouTubers, accountants and blogs create, uh, and blogs create regular content about troubleshooting and tips. So that is it for uh, support and community. So let's talk about security and privacy well security is a big deal for financial software and quickbooks doesn't disappoint uh, it has 128-bit ssl encryption for all data transmission it also has two-factor authentication uh, that is 2fa then uh, uh, there's also uh, frequent backups and cloud uh, redundancy so your data is safe, but always use strong passwords and 2FA. So what are the, uh, the pros and cons of QuickBooks? Uh, number one advantage is uh, it has comprehensive feature set. Then uh, it has clean modern interface. It also has uh, excellent automation or reporting. It has great mobile experience and it has massive integration lab library uh, the disadvantages of quickbooks include um, occasional sync issues with banks and it can be pricey for small businesses uh, learning call for non-accountants so if you are not an accountant or you are not familiar with uh, account technologies uh, you may want to uh, go for training to understand how to use uh, QuickBooks. Then uh, the, the, the other disadvantage is payroll and inventory cost extra. Payroll and inventory cost extra as I've highlighted earlier. So, um, should you use QuickBooks if you're a small to mid sized business? solo premier or an accountant managing client quickbooks is one of the best accounting tools available today it balances power with ease of use and skills with your business if you are just starting out or don't need advanced features you might consider wave which is free or fresh books which is a bit more beginner friendly all right what is my recommendation 
Uh, if you want serious control over your finances with the ability to grow, QuickBooks is a solid investment. And that is it for today's deep dive into QuickBooks. If you found this review helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you never miss an update. Have you got any questions or experiences with QuickBooks? Drop them in the comment section. I would love to hear from you. Catch you in the next one. Thank you.